guys, my name's Grace and in today's video I'm back in GTA Online to purchase the brand new hot rod that's just been added with the Bikers DLC. So this is the DeClasse Tornado Rat Rod. It's $378,000 and as you guys can see it is rusty. Freaking rusty as hell. So let's buy one in orange and I think we are going to be customizing the crap out of this thing. All my garages are full. So I'm just going to put it in place of one of the free like muscle cars that we got. So let's go jump in this thing and take this to the mod shop and make this thing beautiful. I love hot rods. I think this is going to look super epic. It's going to be funny to see how rusted and how like just effed up it is from the start. But let's jump into our garage guys and jump in our new hot rod. And here it is guys. Oh shit. Look how rusted it is. The paint is... Wow. Okay, this thing needs some serious work. Let's jump in this thing. I always jump in the wrong side because I'm Australian, okay? We drive on the other side of the road and we get in the opposite side of the car. People always pick me up on that and yeah, that, that's pretty much why. So let's take this bad boy to the mod shop and do some serious work to it. So from stock, it's, it's a bucket of crap basically. <laughs> it doesn't feel too flash. The steering is pretty horrible. The acceleration is super slow and it doesn't turn very well either. Great. <laughs> Good start. So let's take this bad boy to the mod shop. And I don't really know what is going to be on offer here. I don't know if it's going to have crazy paint jobs. I'm surprised. Do we take this to Benny's or do we take it to this mod shop? I don't even know. Let's check here first. And if not, we may have taken it to the Benny's because it is like a type of car I would expect. Kind of like the lowriders, but it looks like perform. we can do it here. All right, sweet. So what do we got? Let's put, yeah, let's just trick this thing out to the max. So put the best engine on there. What is, whoa, okay. <laughs> Dude, that looks like wings almost. That looks like the engine is about to freaking fly away. That's really cheap. What the hell? Like I'm not going to worry about explosives. Hood, what do we got? Single intake, triple intake, or the stock. I think the triple looks really cool. Yeah, triple. The horn, I'd never worry about the horns. The headlights, I think we will put those on. Neon kits, I'll save till last because I'm not entirely sure what kind of theme I want to go with this thing. Primary color, okay. Cr Why does it look all... Yo, can we make this look pretty first? What is going on with this thing? Why is it so rusty? I'll put the best transmissions on there, the turbo, and I'm wondering if I'm supposed to be taking this to my my biker's place. Okay, I just took this to Benny's and I also took it to my clubhouse because I was kind of confused as to why when I changed the engine and everything, why is it all still rusty? What the, is it, what the fuck? Okay, look at the paint, when I respray. Let's put like a crew. Why is it still all fucked up? I don't understand. <laughs> what? Am I missing something? Hold on. Transmission, we've done. Turbo, we've done. Wheels, we haven't done yet. Windows. I mean, it's kind of. You don't really put tint on this kind of car. I don't understand why it's still rusty. This is really fucking weird. All right, let's take a look at the respray and just pick something anyway. So I think we'll go with. Okay, we can't put Pearlescent on there. Gold, ugh. oh my God, I wish I wasn't locked. Just make it like total rust bucket spec. <laughs> Metallics, this looks kind of cool actually. Um, should we go with like a really, I don't think white looks good. I think maybe a color. Being a hot rod, I think it would almost be a crime to not go with a red. Hot rods and red kind of just go hand in hand. So I, I kind of like the gray thread. I think that's quite fitting. Let's have a look at the other colors though. Hot pink. The bright orange does look quite pretty. I really love that rose yellow as well. Ah, oh, shit. There's so many nice colors, but it looks so fucking weird being all like, all torn up. <laughs> I understand. I must be missing something. I don't get it. But I think I'm going to go with the red, guys. I think the red is going to be the best. Uh, where was it? Blaze, Grace. I kind of like the brighter red. Maybe it's Serena red. 
Yeah, I think that looks cool. Let's go with the Torino red. Okay, let's go with the wheels. The wheels, we will, it only changes the front. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, so I think we should go into Lowrider. Uh, go with stock rims. It's, I know it's a hot rod, not a lowrider as such, but I mean, <laughs> the dollar signs. I don't really know what type of rims are. Let's have a look at muscle maybe. Um, what's the stock one? So it's kind of like classic five spokes, but it's just super deep dish. Um, I think we want to keep it fairly classic, I think. But I think I might go with these, Classic 5. Maybe those ones. Dukes. I think we'll go with Classic 5. I like that because you can see more of the like the disc and the brake caliper. That looks really cool. And we'll also change the tires. We'll put some custom tires on there. Tire enhancement. May as well put bulletproof tires on there. Tire smoke. I think I'll go with black. I think that looks really cool. But I'm still confused. Why is this a rust bucket? <laughs> I don't know, but I think my character looks pretty freaking cool sitting in this thing. So, this is our new rat rod. I don't know why it's a bit a bucket of crap, <laughs> but we're just gonna roll with it. It's a freaking beast, though. Holy shit! Okay, this the like fire coming out of the pipes looks dope. Doesn't steer too well though. Not gonna lie. Let's give it a bit of a test ride and see how this bad boy goes. <laughs> we now have our very own rust bucket. I freaking love it. It's actually pretty. It's actually pretty good. It turns. It turns okay. It's not too bad. The top speed's a little, a little slow. <laughs> when you're used to driving like freaking Zentornos and T20s and shit like that, but this is a pretty cool car. I'm just kind of confused as to why. It is just rusty, I don't know. It's so random. So there you have it guys, this is the Rat Rod and I'm a little bit surprised you can't take it to Benny's or maybe even your own bike shop mechanic or something just to put those little finishing touches on it being a hot rod. But the name does kind of speak for itself I think. Being a Rat Rod, maybe it's supposed to be rusty, it's supposed to be kind of like a Frankenstein of a car and I think it's kind of cool. It's reasonably cheap, it's like $375,000 and then a little bit extra to upgrade and stuff. So in terms of GTA cars, that is pretty cheap. So I figure it's kind of cool. I don't mind it. I don't know how much I'm going to use it, but it's probably good to take place of one of those crappy like muscle cars that I got for free anyway. So I'm going to take it into the garage, guys, and we're going to have a quick look around the car. But this is pretty much it for the customization. I'm also going to be doing the LCC Sanctus the like Halloween motorcycle that is going to be going up tomorrow guys. So if you're watching this video and you haven't seen it, make sure you go check it out. But here we have it guys, the Declass Tornado Rat Rod. I have to say, I kind of really love the front of it. The front looks super badass. It does look like an eagle spreading its wings. Like it, the pipes look super cool. And when you are driving it, the fire coming out of it does look pretty dope. So for a reasonably priced car, I think it's kind of cool to pick it up and just have a little bit of variety in your garage. As you can see, my garage is looking pretty colorful right now, and I think this looks really cool. So that pretty much does it, guys, for the Declass Tornado Rat Rod customization. If you guys want to see more of these types of videos, let me know down in the comment section below. But that is all for the video today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe as well for me. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Yeah, we're in the classroom. Hey, friends. Okay, this is beautiful. <gasps> Did you guys see that? I am not... No.